Not fooling anyone, Lloyd.
648, he was walking home with the blood on his hands from a broken nose. But like every other day, he was scared to go back to his house because his pops was home. Drowning his troubles in whiskey bubbles, just looking for trouble. Well, there's no excuse for the things he did, but there's a lot at home that he's dealing with. Because his dad's been drunk since he was a kid, and I hope one day that'll say to him, Put down those bubbles and that belt buckle in this broken bubble. Daddy. Now 
Well, tell me your name. Damn. I almost let you go. Who is this? I don't remember my name. Why not? It's the first thing you lose. First thing you lose when? You know when. How do you know my name? We met once. Your arm is mint. You almost had me. Bruce? Bushimata? Yeah. Bruce. Uh, I'm Bruce. Your arm is mint. You almost had me. Did the phone ring for you? It rang, but none of us heard it. Just you. The grabber hears the phone too, but he doesn't want to believe it. Why are you calling me? Your arm is mint. You almost had me. I'm glad it's you. Finny? Yeah? There's a dirt section of the floor in the hallway where the tile is loose. Okay. Dig down underneath the foundation. I tried, but there wasn't time for me to dig up and out the other side. We'll have enough time. Hello? Don't go upstairs. Why not? It's a trap. Are you? Are you Bruce? Who's Bruce? I, I was just talking to Bruce. He's the baseball player. We don't play baseball here. Who are you? I don't remember. Did you play soccer, football? I delivered newspapers. Billy. You're Billy Showalter. Maybe. No, you're Billy. What is he doing? He's waiting. On the other side with that fucking belt. He didn't say you can leave. So if you try, he'll punish you. 
I'll beat you with that belt till you pass out. It hurts, kid. It hurts real bad. You cry. You beg him to stop. We all did. But he just keeps beating you. You said my name was Billy. Billy Showalter. Don't call me that. I don't remember it. It's not who I am now. What do you want me to call you then? What do you remember? I told you. I was a paper boy. Okay. Paper boy. See the wall in front of you? See the wall separated from the floor? Yeah. I tore a long cable loose from down there. I kept it hidden. What am I supposed to do with that? Hello? 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 You don't have much time. The grabber hasn't been sleeping. He thinks this might be it, that he's gonna figure it out. Who's gonna figure it out? His brother upstairs. <laughs> Are you Griffin? Who? You're from Sag. Probably. It's all a little hazy, but I imagine you know all our names. Every kid does. I didn't know you. Nobody did. You spent so many years invisible, and then every kid in the state knows your name. You don't have much time. Why hasn't he killed me? He won't play the game. You have to play the game. If you don't play, he can't win. What game? Naughty Boy. If you don't play Naughty Boy, the grabber can't beat you. And if he can't beat you, he can't move on to the next part. And the next part of Naughty Boy was his favorite part. What's the next part? You said that. He's not been sleeping. You said that too. Yeah, well, he is now in his chair. He passed out waiting for you to play. What good does that do me? Wait, the door's still unlocked. The door is still unlocked. Do I just go? There's a combination lock on the inside of the storm door. It was my bike lock. Your bike lock? Yeah, he took it when he took me. What's the combination? I don't remember. Griffin. I remember being afraid I'd forget it. That's why I wrote it down. What? Where? I carved it with a bottle cap in the wall. Which wall? Which wall? The one on your right. About shoulder height when you're sitting down. Two three three one seven. 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 If you say so. What is it? Twenty three thirty one seven or twenty three three seventeen or two thirty three seventeen. I can't remember. Griffin. I can't remember. You'll have to try them all, and you'll have to be very quiet about it. Yeah. Okay. Thanks. What? You gonna say something? Do you even know who you are? What the shit kind of question is that? Do you even know who you are? I'm Finney Blake. Hell, yeah, well, nice to fucking meet you, Finney Blake. Right here. This is it. This is what? The horrifying nightmare end of your pathetic little life. Holy shit. You're Vance Hopper. I remember you. You should scare me. Trust me, Finny Blake. If you knew what you had coming, you'd be fucking terrified. Today's the day, motherfucker! Stacking the carpets to reach the window? I've tried everything. No, not everything. 
When the grabber saw what I had done, that was it. And he took his time with me, too. What did you do? Oh, that fuck tried to spend a fortune repair all the damages. What did you do? I'm getting to that, cuntwad. Or do you have some other important shit you have to do right now? No, 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 no. I'm, I'm listening. There's an outlet in the shitter across from the John. Yeah, I see it. On the other side of that wall, there's a storage room. You can't get into that room because there's a big ass up right freezer in the way. Okay. Bring it to the wall about two feet above the outlet till you get to a panel with screws in it. Get the panel off, you're into the freezer. And then out into the storage room. Thank you. For what? For helping me. Helping you? This isn't about you! Fuck! <laughs> Robin? Hey, buddy. Don't cry. I'm not. Yes, you are. I can see you. You can? I'm with you. I've been with you this whole time. You have? A man never leaves a friend behind. My dad didn't leave his buddies behind when he went to Nam. That's why he didn't come home. And I'm not coming home either. And I'm not going to leave you behind. What would you get her against him? Fuck that. You ain't gonna go like I did. I've tried everything. Nothing's worked. Yet. Robin. You remember what I told you? That I needed to see Texas Chainsaw Massacre? Before that. If someday I have to stand up for myself. Someday is today, Finn. Today is the day you stop taking shit from anybody. I'm not a fighter like you, Robin. You can even take him. You've always been a fighter, Finn. That's what we have in common. While we were friends, you were always afraid to throw a punch, but you always knew how to take one. And you always caught back up. Every time. I'm not strong enough. You have to be. You're getting out of here. If you can't do it for you, do it for me. What does it matter? Because I don't want to die for nothing. I want to at least have died for a friend. And because I can't kill that hijo de puta, you have to do it for me. How? You're gonna use a weapon. What weapon? The one in your hand. The phone? Fill the receiver with dirt. Pack it in tight. Give it some heft. Then what? Then you practice. Over and over. You raise the phone. Take a fast step back. Step forward, step back, and swing. Try it. No? Yes. You raise the phone. Take a fast step back, step forward, step back, and swing. Again, you raise the phone. Take a fast step back, step forward, step back, and swing. Again, you raise the phone. Take a fast step back, step forward, step back, and swing. Again, you raise the phone. Take a fast step back, step forward, step back, and swing. <laughs> You've got it. Now fill the phone with dirt like I told you. Will I still be able to talk with you? This was the last call, Finn. Saw you from here on out. I miss you, Robin. Then get out for me. Use what we gave you. I will. Bye, Finn. Bye, Robin. Why hasn't he killed me?
time. I'm not getting out of here. I'm not getting out of here. I'll bet you I can run faster in the wind. You are special, Finny. I'm gonna take my time. I want this to really hurt. Is for you. Welcome to the nightmare end of your pathetic little life. <laughs> you don't watch that. <laughs> Today's the day, motherfucker. I can't kill you, you little Buddha. So Finn is gonna do it for me. Finn's are his men. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>